Have you noticed that Capcourt has started locking more and more of their futures behind their pro subscription? For those of us who rely on their free features to edit our videos and do a lot of things, this can be really frustrating. But guess what? In today's video, I'm going to show you how you can use all these pro features without paying a dime. So stick around and watch this video to the end. And also let me know in the comment section if you find this video helpful. Let's dive right in. After shooting your video, go ahead and import your video to CapCut. Go ahead and use all the pro features you want to use. I've made a full tutorial on how to edit your video using CapCut. You can click the link here to watch it. So right now I'm done with all my edits and you can see above here, this pro was not there before. But because I've used their pro feature, I wouldn't be able to export this video. If I click on export now, you can see. So you are going to swipe down on your phone. And you are going to screen record your entire video so once you are done with your screen record you are going to come back to your cap court and you click on new project again and you import the video you just screen recorded and you add it as a new project click on the video scroll to the right click on transform click on crop and you are going to crop it crop it nicely like this after cropping it, my video is for YouTube, so I'm going to change the aspect ratio. So you click on aspect ratio and I'm going to click on 16 ratio 9 because that is the YouTube format. If you are going to upload yours on Instagram, click on 1 ratio 1 or if it's for TikTok, click on 9 ratio 16, just like that. But I'll leave mine on YouTube and I'll click on my video again, then you expand it like this nicely. Then you scroll to the back of your video, you can see the screen here. You click on this split and you delete it or you click on the video, you drag it like this and that ending part is going to be deleted. This process also works if you are using an Android phone or any type of phone. Just screen record your screen and crop it. And if you want to use it on your PC, you have to screen record your PC as well. That is just the whole process. If you find this video helpful, please go ahead and subscribe to my channel and let me know in the comment section if this video has helped you so far. Bye for now.